Kim Blensinger for directing our choir, for Nancy Morton accompanying them. This beautiful selection on this beautiful <coughs> first Sunday of June. At this time, uh, I'd like to invite uh, Jim Gleason to come forward. And as the fine ends were, were sharing at the microphone, I was, uh, was going to say, oh no, this is your last Sunday. Oh, you totally forgot about this being your last Sunday. But that would have not been true. The Lord didn't let me say that. <laughs> uh, I'd like Earl, uh, Earl and Gail also to, to come forward uh, at this time. Earl, Earl and Gail, would you come forward? And Jim has something special he'd like to, to say to us this morning. Our Asbury Church has certainly been blessed over the years with very engaged members of our congregation who share their gift and graces in all different ways that a family needs to be what we are today. And an inspiring example of that is certainly the fine family. Earl and Gail have been such a blessing to this family. And we evidently have a tradition with being a new person I really didn't know, but uh, on behalf of the Asbury Church, the Asbury United Methodist men have put together a gift for you to take to your new home. And a number of people had an opportunity to sign this already. At the end of service, we'll have a parlor for those of you who don't come down to coffee. We hope you do to celebrate the finals. But if you don't, it'll be right over here. And then we'll have it downstairs. We ask you to sign your name because nowadays we have so many members, there's not a whole lot of room on this. But now there's a hidden tradition behind this. As I found out by talking to Peg, for example, and to Joe and Pat Peach, once you've got this and you take it with you, there's a tendency to come back home sometime <laughs> in the future. And it could be decades later. So this is a reminder on your wall that you always have a place in our hearts, in our home here. And if light brings you back here, just bring it back to your next wall. Thank you. I'm going to hang on to this so we can get signed for you. But hey, on behalf of everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so very, very much. I had a whole speech prepared. By the time I got the third word out, it, my mind went blank. But I just could not thank you enough for everything you've been to us in this church. I love you so dearly and for the sentiments. Thank you. Ways beyond which we could ask or even think, 
and that you bless their hearts, their homes, and their continuing relationship with the body of Christ. May they be a part of the greatest story ever told. We send them and we ask your richest blessing upon them that they may continue to be a blessing in your kingdom. And all God's people said, Amen. 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 Do join us downstairs. <laughs> okay. That's for early day. That's for everyone who's here. We've uh, a little something. As we and uh, and, and uh, the doll side of the family, they would say, too much is just enough. Amen. Right? And, and so please join us downstairs afterwards. And make sure I say a grace at the very end of the service so that we can just all go down and form two lines on the both sides of the table. <laughs> Amen.